Hi everyone, it's Kim from Affordably Crafty here with not a video I do too frequently. Happy mail! I want to thank those who sent this stuff. I think it'll be awesome unboxing. Um, I am not going to... We'll get to that in a second. Hi there, I'm Kim. If you're new here, welcome. My channel is all about teaching you how to stretch your craft dollar and be affordably crafty. Let me put this down. Please like, share, and subscribe. Whoops. Also, follow me on Facebook. No, sorry, wrong. Follow me on Instagram and join my Facebook, where I post about all my deal steals and freebies I find in my travels in the crafting world. So, hello. <laughs> um, I don't, I have not done a lot of Happy Mail videos. Um, but I had gotten some of this a little while ago. And I just decided to open it all together. And I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> So I have a P.O. box. It's linked in the bottom of all my videos. Um, just for your guys' information. Now let's see if I can open these without being horrendous. Let's see. Oh, probably this one's better. I'm going to use my biggest, least sharp scissors I own, right? Because that's what you do. These big guys. Let's see. <laughs> This is exciting. So there had been some folks who had mentioned on a live that they were interested in sending me some novelty yarn since I really do enjoy working with it. Oh, this is amazing. It's exciting. What does this say? It says, here's some novelty yarn for you. I hope you will like it. They really enjoy, enjoy watching Affordably Crafty and you rock awesome so i'm not going to be like saying people's names on here because i don't know if they think that's cool or not a kosher i should say Ooh, look at that one bora bora one yarn a thousand sensations this is 100 percent nylon 118 yards made in, in italy that's cool so there's one so this is like a a thin yarn with these little floofy bits that come off of it two three of these. That is awesome. I love that. Cool. Oh, look at that. So this is, says dream. Love the label there. How cool that is. This is 65 nylon, 35 wool, 40 yards, and it's made in Italy. And this is kind of like a ladder yarn with but it's kind of mixed together. So it's got ladder yarn kind of portion and then it has this, uh, these pieces, the thread with the floofy bits, that's cool. It's very like almost neon-esque colors. Isn't that pretty? Knit one, pearl two, Baton Rouge. So this is 100% nylon made in England, 153 yards. This is really pretty. It's very soft feeling. I like that it's a neutral. Is it the same brand? Yep, same brand, but oh, look at these cool variegated blue colors. I like that a lot. Or these two would go great together also. Ooh, I like that. Very cool. What's this one? Bernat Knit or Not. Ooh, this is really nice. Look at that. So this is one of those varying texture yarns. So it's got, looks like acrylic maybe. Some that's just a, um, what do you call it? Thread. And then there also is a glittery bit with floofies on it. I think those are the four. Looks like those are the four. Oh wait, what's that? Nope, those are the four that I think are in here. So this is Bernat Knit or Not. Oh, so this is from July, 2013. So some of the Bernat and some other yarns have a date on here. So this one is 7, 2013. Um, made in Turkey. This is the color purple glitter, which is my favorite color. It's a bulky five and it is 37 acrylic, 36 polyester, 14 nylon and 13 wool, approximately a hundred yards. 
<clears throat> and there is a <clears throat> knit pattern on the label. Isn't that pretty? Love that. What are these? Twin Spin by Darico. It's like this. It is, -ba -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. are these the same? No, those are different yarns. Hang tight. <laughs> so this one is got some like chenille looking stuff and then it has eyelash. 60% polyester, 40% acrylic, 50 grams. Mm. This is the color earth. This says 2005 on it. That's very nice. We got here. Oh, I like these. Pat and CC. I saw this, I think, when I was just at the reuse store, but it was black and white. 68 acrylic, 32 nylon, 36 yards, and the color, the color number dial up, the color parade. Look how pretty that is. Is that not cool? So this is <clears throat> A thread that has little floofs and then it has these like popcorn bits on it. It's really cool. And it's a six, six weight. Uh, Palette Collection, Create Your Own Masterpiece. This is by palettyarn.com. Hmm. In the color purple, made in China. 65 acrylic, 28 wool, seven nylon, 16 yards. But that is cool. So that has, okay, it's not, see how this one is balls? S kind of similar construction, except this one is little loops. So there actually is a hole in the middle. This is not loop it yarn, I don't think, though. If anybody's worked with this, correct me if I'm wrong. Are you supposed to work in the loops or not the loops on this? Let me know down below. Ooh, another palette yarn. This is series 33. This was series 42. This is 56 wool, 11 nylon. Is this the same? These look like they're the same yarns, but different colors. So this one is 56 wool, 11 nylon, 33 polyester, 51 yards in the color grape juice. So this one has big pieces of roving coming off of it that kind of fly about. And then it's got a thread and some roving on the bottom. It also comes in, oh, I love this peacocky type color. Look at that. Oh, I love that. That's the color marine. Those are cool. I should have put a box over here. Then we have Flapper by Derrico, and this looks like it's an eyelash yarn. See? Eyelash. Made in China, and it is the color Eagle Print. 100% polyester, 50 grams. It's very soft. Very, very soft. What's this one? Filati Moira. And this one is 68 nylon, nylon, 20 acrylic, 12 mohair, 82 yards in the color Tintata. So this is a uh, lower weight yarn. Let me see if I can, doesn't have that, but it has a chain spun construction. And then it looks like they're like, they're not raffia, but fabric, like, it's like they tied on a piece of fabric here in the middle, kind of. It's got three little floofs tied into the chain. That's nice. And then we've got two more flappers by Doris, and these are in the color white. And then we also have a uh, Forensia yarn from the Plymouth Italian collection uh, from the Plymouth Yarn Company, made in Italy. And this is ooh, 30 wool, 30 acrylic, 40 nylon, 55 yards. And it has a color number, but wow, is that not soft and super floofy. I love those colors. Awesome. I'm just gonna put this stuff back in. 
Hang tight. Hang in. I love all that stuff. So cool. I say my favorites out of this box are probably this, this one here, this neon. Of course, you had me at purple and glitter. And then I really like this one. And for sure, I love the colors on this. Or at least my daughter will love that. Love them. That was box number one. Thank you so much. You know who you are. And here is box number two. Um... Oh boy, this is some heavy duty tape here. Ooh, Jiminy. Jiminy Cricket. I feel like we're pointing too high at the ceiling else feel like that that's much better sorry about that angle for the first box oh my god this is like oh boy this is serious tape nobody's breaking into this bad boy hold on a second that took a while to open that was crazy pants and inside this we have a bag a bag A note, I should say. A note. Oh, awesome! Hi, Kim. I've sent you a couple skeins of what I refer to as my vintage Jiffy yarns. I hope you enjoy it and can use it for whatever it can make. Thank you for your affordably, affordably crafty channel. Well, thank you. You know who you are. Thank you so much. That's very, very thoughtful. Oh, that's fun. Oh, cool. So I had been talking on a live about how I've never had the original Jiffy brand. So they re-released it from the vault. Where did I put that? That's over there somewhere. It's around. I don't remember where I put it. Um, so she sent me some original Jiffy yarn. Look. Lion brand yarn Jiffy. Isn't that pretty? It is... Quick and easy mohair look yarn. Machine washable and dryable. 100% acrylic. 2.5 ounces, 70 grams, 115 yards, or 105 meters. Made in Turkey. And this is, oops, just the color, nope, Detroit. This is the color Detroit. But, ooh, see, it's got that, that nice halo that the Jiffy yarn has. You can see that nice halo there. And it is in some really nice pastel white, blue, and pink. How much? Let's see. This is 115 yards. And she sent me five of them. How cool is that? Ha! Thank you so much. Oh, my, my brain is... Oh, wait. Was there a pattern on that? Let's look. Knit or crochet this practical hooded bobble baby blanket. Well, I won't be making that, but I'm sure I'll make something amazing with it. Are they all the same? Yep. Thank you so much. Much appreciated. Okay. Hang tight. Oh, Lord. Okay. Our next one. This is making a clinky clink sound. Hold on. boy. That's fun. What is this? Let's see. Come on. You can do it. Found three skeins of my purple yarn at my Hobby Lobby. Saw the mini shopping cart and thought of your channel. Watch you and Ginger every week. Enjoy your channel content. Keep up the good work. If I am done with my rug, maybe a small one for the cats to match. That is so thoughtful. That is so thoughtful. You know who you are. Oh my goodness. 
Look, that's so cute. Look at that. Oh my goodness, look. Is that not the coolest? Oh, look at that. That's awesome. Oh, I love that. It's purple too. You were correct. I L O V E that. That is awesome. There we go. Oh, yes. Thank you so much. So, this is the showstopper knit and hyacinth. I'm sorry, delphinium that I have been making my rug out of. And no, I can add more rounds. So, I'm super excited. Probably can get one or two more rounds out of this. That's awesome. Thank you so much. Yay. Happiness. Thank you. I love love. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. I bought out all the stores near me as far as that's concerned. All right. One more left. Ooh. What is this? there a card with this? Is there a card? I look for a card. Oh, it's way on the bottom. I opened the wrong end. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, that is so, so nice. Look at that nice card. Is that pretty? All right, I'm gonna read this afterwards because it's talking about stuff that's made in here. So we're just gonna hang tight on that. I'll read it after. Oh, look at that. Knit Pal Retro Glam Yarn. Ooh, that is nice. I don't know if I wanna open that yet. It is... Where is the... There's all the information on the side I can't read. It's a three weight. It is the color electric blue. I don't know if this company's in business anymore. Knit Pal, it says they have a monthly yarn giveaway. 10% off your future purchases, Knit Pal 10. It is 320 yards, 43 polyester, 57 acrylic, DK weight, machine wash, hand washing recommended, dry flat, in the shade. Never seen that before. So there's four of these, and then look at these ones. There's four in this pretty green color, and this is the color... Metallic Sparkle Olive Green. And this is the color um, White Pearl. Look at how pretty those are. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Oh, I can't wait to try those out. I've never had this yarn before. Thank you. Tape up. Ooh. <gasps> These are so nice. Oh my goodness. to go like that. No, I think it's the other way. Is it the other way? No, that can't be right. Hold on. Figuring this out. Is there a thumb hole? I don't see one. Look at that. Is that not pretty? Oh my goodness. I love these. L-O-V-E. L-O-V-E. These are awesome. Thank you so much. I actually don't have anything that looks dragon scale like this. This is amazing. It feels so nice. <gasps> oh, I know she wrote about that in the card. I'm going to read it after. Oh, that's so pretty. Thank you. Metallic, like maple earrings. Can you see? Oh, that's the wrong side. <laughs> that's beautiful. Thank you so much. It says, Art by Marie. There's another little box. Another one says Art by Marie. Oh, look. 
These are green, same kind of design. Oh, I love that, hang tight. I love that, that's awesome. Thank you so much. Now the question is, which one do I put on first? Hmm. And then there's, hang tight, magenta. Whoa! What is that? That's cool! Oh, let me read the outside. <laughs> it says, magenta textiles, metallic glitter. And there's information on the inside. So see that? It says, it's a super fine one. Each ball is 1.4 ounces, 40 grams, 284 yards or 260 meters. 79 acrylic, 13 polyamide, and 8% polyester. Knitting needle, 2.75. Crochet hook, 3.25. Hand wash preferred, machine wash, cold water on delicate cycle. Do not tumble dry. And it is made in Mexico. Whoa, these are cool. Hold on, let me put this box down. Too many boxes. Whoa. Look at that. Oh my goodness, that is so awesome. That is so metallic. Oh my goodness, I love that. So yes, it definitely is a one weight, but it is so like vibrant with the color. Look, purple. Ah! Hot pink. <gasps> Orange. Oh my goodness gracious. Yellow. <gasps> oh my gosh. Lime green, Kelly green. Oh wait, some of these, some of these have gold and some of them have silver. So pink, dark purple, light purple, yellow, and green have silver, the lime green. The dark green have orange and the orange has silver. And then we have a royal blue, a, like a, burgundy cranberry type color and doo -doo -doo -doo, ah, too many, too many. silver let's see if i can hold all these at once it's a little challenging because they are small balls hold on Oh my goodness, those are amazing. Those are amazing. Oh, so amazing. I love it. That's cool. Cinnamon, would this work for you? I know they're one weights, but I mean, for your Jade and Stitches blanket, you get all these colors. I'll have to look. It looks like it came from Amazon, so I'll have to look it up. Unless I'm wrong. All right, let me look at the card. Now it might make a little sense now that I've opened it. Let's see. Hi, Kim. I hope you enjoy your Happy Mail. The gloves were made using Barocco spray. I was so excited when you did a review on that yarn. I've had it in my stash for about a year. The thumb hole will be after the fifth row from the top. One, two, three, four, five. I don't know. I'll find it after. I like them like this anyways. Um... I thought about you when I saw this yarn. I have not used it, so I don't really know how it works up. It is all from Knit Pals. The colors in the box you were going to use for a blanket, either with a white or black yarn, to make a satin bow blanket. The other two small boxes are what I sell as a living. I make jewelry using copper, brass, bronze, and some sterling silver. Thank you for being you and sharing with all of us. You and Ginger are amazing. All of my love and hugs. Um, do you have a website, Marie? Now I am saying her name because clearly she's, she's telling me basically to tell everybody about this. Do you have a website? Um, comment down below and I will put it in the description box. Or if you're on Etsy or where you are, 
um, let me know. But these are awesome. And I'll see if I can find these on Amazon because I'm sure some folks will be interested. I will link that down below as well if I find it. Um, but yeah, such fun with the Happy Mail. Thank you guys. I really appreciate it. Um, it's always fun to get something surprise in the mail. All right, that's it for today. Please like, share, and subscribe so your friends can learn to be affordably crafty too. Oh wait, I put them on backwards. <laughs> I see the thumb hole now. Let me fix it. Oops. Found it. <clears throat> like this. Ow. Yeah, that kind of makes more sense. Although I do like them the other way too. Let's see if I can find the other thumb hole. Where are you, thumbhole? Gotta be in here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's try that again. Okay. Oh, even better. But I do like them the other way, too. So, versatile. Look at that. So cool. Thank you so much. All right. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe so your friends can learn to be affordably crafty, too. Um, and have a creative day, everyone. Bye-bye.